go from your first few thousand today up to your first hundred thousand. I mean, this is where we start the grind. This is how we make ourselves, you know, get up there with the best. So I am going to go through this and I'm going to show you some stuff now and we're going to make some money. Okay, so starting off, I think the easiest way is buying persistent change um, stuff. So if we go over um, to this, I'm going to quickly look. I'm going to look at the position change cards. Hi, if you're joining the stream, hi guys, how are you? Hope you're all well. Um, hi Ellie, nice to see you. Um, so we're going to have a look and I would say start off with the main ones, the CDM to CM, CAM to CM, centre forward to CAM, left mid, left wing, right mid, right wing. So we're looking at, I don't know, let's start off with CF's CAM because they are quite expensive. So I'm going to go across. Go down, get the position training on. All right, there we go. Position modifier, don't need to mess around with that. And we're going to go CF to CAM. Now, these I think are going for about 1800. And when I first started, these were really easy to start making money. So, we're going to do there. We go, there's one if we could get it, but we're not going to have time. We're going to try and snipe them for less, even that'll do. Oh, it's gone. I am not the fastest at sniping, as you can tell, but the technique is there. The other thing I like now is I've changed it slightly so you can make it easier to snipe. Just gonna, but yeah, you get. The gist, I'm just a really crappy sniper. But when you, you first start off, this is a very good way of making a lot of coins. Very quickly, you see how quickly they go. And I've bid on it, but I haven't bought it because I'm a genius. Um, but yeah, we're going to bid on all of You'd bid on all of these. You'd, I've bid them all. Um, I just want to pick up one. We are going to pick up one, and then we'll move on to my next step. We pick one up for 16. I want to try and set for 18. As I said, this isn't going to be massive amounts of coin, but you know, when you're starting off with a few thousand, that'll get you 300 coins. And we really kind of, as I said, that when those ponds pop up that are worth, you know, 600, 700, people just discard these for next to nothing. We can pick them up. And we'll make a few coins here and there. And as you can imagine, if you can buy these for, I don't know, a few hundred each, um, they're going to make you five, six hundred go. Um, my team at the moment is non-existent. I've pretty much put them all up for sale. Um, but yeah, with this, the um, position method, it will pick you up between a thousand and well, five hundred to a thousand coins per one. As I said, you can use any of the other ones, but just make sure when you do it, you go to the buy it now, find the lowest price it's going for, and pick them up. So that's the first one. That should help you get to 10 to 15,000. Then we're going to look at different things. So we're now going to look at chemistry types. Now, there are two main ones that you'd be looking at if you're going to make an absolute fortune on these. So the two you're going to be looking at are Hunter. And the other one we're going to be looking at is Shadow. These are the two easiest ways to make coins. Um, so this would be, for me, the two best ones to use. So let's go across to Shadow. Um, we'll just These are probably going for about 2 or 3k, but we'll have a quick look. And between now and the end of well, probably the end of next month. These will probably go to near 5k, I would say. Hunter will definitely go extinct because people want them and we just missed out that. That would have been an insane snipe. But yeah, again, you know, again, that would have been a thousand profit there. So that's another one for you. So once you're getting that, that's another way. And that will probably help you get up to around 15 to 20k. So there are two options there. Um, ways that are working for me at the moment, I am using position change cards. 
So for me, you're looking at, give me one second, one player I've been using is Dusan Tadic. So he has been going for a ridiculous amount of money. So because he's needed, he's one of the kind of players that is needed for the um, SPCs. I can't remember which one it is, but it's one where you need 11 players from different teams. Uh, from Yeah, 11 players from the same uh, nationality with different teams. You're going to be looking for Dusan Tadic or Jadic. Um, and you can position change them to centre forwards. It'll cost you around 800 to do. You can pick these up for around 600. And if you do that, you'll be looking to be able to sell them for around 2425. So again, another five or 600 coins. Um, yeah, it's just well, once you're up to around 10 or 15k, position changes that work really well. I mean, you've got Verratti, he sells a lot, um, and he's an 86, and for eight or nine grand, it's not going to stay that way. Now, another one I like, works really well for me, um, is Thomas Muller. So I can pick him up for CF, it's going to cost me five or 600 to change his position. I am then selling him on. Um, for around 13 to 14 grand last week i was selling for around 15 to 16 grand so it was really really good and we we're making an absolute fortune from this so that is probably the way that i would say going forward after you've done the first you've got yourself up to around 15 to 20k so i would say do that that's a good start that'll be two to three k after the, tr the position change cost and the ea tax i would say that'll be making around three or four k per card so that's another way um i'll show you some of the other cards that are on my transfer list i've got two cells so <coughs> again this shows um as a cf but he is actually a striker so this is what i was exactly showing you before all the players i list are up as a striker um but when they sell they some for some reason show as a cf so i would say this guy, I was, I, I picked him up, and to be honest, I'm never going to need him, so I was quite lucky in this. Um, picked him up for nothing uh, because I packed him, and he's going for. I just put him up for 70k. It was kind of, you know, lazy bids. So someone's picked that up. I do not know how that's happened, but I just made 70 grand profit on that. Um, sorry, no, 66 and a half grand profit after the EA tax. Again, these are being bought for like nine to nine and a half grand because the prices are slowly rising. But at the moment, that's still three grand profit. After EA tax, you're looking at around two and a half grand per card. So as I said, once you've got 40 to 50 grand, you can buy three or four of these. They will sell. You'll probably sell one an hour. So you'll be making three or four grand an hour. It's not going to, you know, it's not going to, make you millions but it'll get you to that hundred thousand coins mark um i also think if you're looking for a good um trade look for these at discard price there's a lot of people who are still discarding these at discard price again i don't know why um i can see these being needed in prayer the month very very soon um richarlison as well i think i've got two or three of these pick them up for around 23 24k um as soon as he plays he goes up to 35 36 now he had a massively good start to the season i think he scored four or five goals it only takes one or two games and this could easily go back up um he gets team of the week he's an 81 the pace is good could go up to i don't know 85 86 um and you're looking at a really solid card then for a left midfielder I mean, he's not going to have the pace of, you know, Neymar or Mbappe or anything like that. But that's still a solid card. Um, Aguero, this card will rise next week. I'm just playing the game, seeing if I can sell him, buy him back for cheaper, and then sell him again. Muller again, I've put him to a striker. Socrates, I've just listed him up for top price because someone made lazy buy him. Uh, and then again, I'm just picking these up. I'm kind of mass bidding them. I'm picking them up and I'm selling them for a little bit more. Um, so yeah, I would say um, if you're looking for sniping filters, have a look at Muller. He is one that I have been using. Um, as you can see, I've had a few. Um, I was picking these up for 700 each and these are selling. So I would say concentrate on your goalkeepers. Try Zoet. 
Um, he's currently going for a thousand, but you can pick him up for around six. Uh, I think around four or five hundred, to be honest. Um, so again, another eight hundred profit there. Douglas Costa, I packed him. So again, uh, Verratti, again, he's going for around seven or eight grand. And to be honest, he is disgustingly cheap for the money. Um, as soon as any of the big SBCs come out, he is going to go up to 50, 60 grand. You're going to make 40 to 50 grand a card. Easy. So again, I am just trading, buying more, trading, buying more. And every time I get the money to pay for it, I keep one in the club. Uh, Mandonda, again, packed him. Giroud. It's quite funny how good um, players like Giroud are when it comes to headers from corners and crosses because of his physicality and his height. Um, I think that this game has slightly changed this year, so that is someone who I think is worth a little bit more than this card. Uh, Matip, again, he isn't going to change the world, but again, he's a solid player for the start. Uh, Soma, I am waiting for the German Player of the Month to come out, so I think he will make a coin again. Uh, as for the Quater, I bought him 50 grand. I am flipping him constantly. People keep buying him. I don't know why, but it does work. Um, again, for again, we've got a few of these guys. Lacazette is another player that I've been flipping. If you follow me on Twitter, you'll see I have flipped him probably 10 times this week, making around four or five grand a card. Um, again, Mata is one I've been picking up for around two six, selling for four grand. Again, another card that flips quite well. So yeah, let's have a quick look see the others. So that Cadzio that I sold, I have bought another one and relisted him. Fingers crossed we can do the same thing again. Courtois again, he is going to be wanted for weekend league, so I bought him as well with the money, um, and that's about it. So that's to get you up to the first hundred thousand coins. If you do want me to carry on and make another video going on for 100 to 250,000, please do like. If this reaches 100 likes, I will do another video. So, guys, I hope this has helped. You know, if you have any questions about how this works, if you don't understand, give me a message underneath, message me on Twitter, um, and I will go into details more with you. Guys, thanks for watching. Goodbye.